There are three fine actresses on the shortlist tonight. The performances that ju the judges singled out was, they said, a display of acting that had it all. It was brave, it was unusual, it was big, it was bold, but it was, al it was also heart heartbreakingly affecting in its quiet moments. It marked a sea change in the way we show and see ourselves on stage. And this performance was even more delicious because it was utterly unexpected. The woman in question had been lost to the stage, but fortunately she returned, triumphantly taking ownership of one of the greatest and most difficult roles ever written and made us see it completely anew. It is my profound honor and privilege to present the Evening Standard Natasha Richardson Award for Best Actress for her extraordinary performance in King Lear to the incomparable Glenda Jackson. was feeding myself by being a professional actress, um, I never got a good notice in the Evening Standard. <laughs> and when I changed direction and became a Labour MP, I was the wrong political party for the Evening Standard. <laughs> so it has come something of a surprise um, to receive this award from a London newspaper owned by a Russian, that isn't a racist remark, and whose editor is a conservative. So I'm left wondering what did I wrong, do wrong? So thank you very much indeed. <laughs> <laughs> 